All right, welcome back to Investor Intel. I'm here today with George Putnam from Scandium International Mining Corp. George, people are excited about different energy metals and so on. Lots of people know about lithium, but Scandium may not be quite as much on their radar. Can you tell me why an investor should be paying attention to Scandium right now? Sure, Jeff. Uh, Scandium is uh, it's a light transition metal, and it's a terrific uh, grain refiner and additive for aluminum alloys. Okay, so why why would investors find that to be exciting? Is that is there a particular part of the market? Well, that... uh, scandium will literally potentially make a whole new class of aluminum alloys. Okay, uh, it brings all kinds of wonderful properties plus strength to uh, to aluminum alloys, and we think there's a real market for that. We know there's a real market for that. Certainly, this plays into the lightweighting trend that's uh, that's on everybody's uh, lips today. Okay, well, you made an announcement at the end of January of a letter of intent for a new uh, venture. Can you tell me more about that? Sure. We've actually made three okay. announcements in January. We've done one uh, with AML, which is in the additive manufacturing or the 3D printing space. That one's very exciting. Okay. We've made another one in the casting space with Omen Hamer, which is a German company. And the one we just made yesterday was with a Swedish company called Grangis, which is a very significant producer of heat exchangers and radiators uh, globally. George, can you tell me a little bit more specifically about the press release with Grangis? Sure. This one is probably the most significant of the three that we've done in, in, here in January. Grangis is a world producer of, a world-sized producer of heat exchangers. They claim to have uh, twenty percent of the world's heat exchanger market in the automotive business. Scandium will, in their metals, will help them make lighter, stronger, more efficient radiators. And we believe that's the case. We came to them. They knew about Scandium. They believe that's the case. We need to test it now and uh, and understand uh, and understand where we can where we can take it from there. But it's very exciting and very significant for the company. So now that. Would that be one of your core markets? Um, yes, it would. It could potentially be a very significant market for us. All three of them could be significant markets. Uh, the casting space and certainly the, the radiator space are bigger than additive manufacturing, which is just in its nascent growth phase. But yes, they're all significant, and uh, there are many others that could be significant too. What other announcements should investors be watching for as catalysts for the stock? Well, we're, what we're doing here is we're showing, we're painting a path for investors to see where we're going. We're on our way to, uh, to uh, uh, achieving offtake agreements in, in Scandium and in Master Alloy, and really to find customers in industry segments that will take up Scandium. We we need to provide them with material that they can test in their labs in a com on a commercial basis to demonstrate the efficacy of scandium. And yeah. with that, then the, uh, the demand for uh, scandium is very much established in their businesses. So that was what drove the, the most recent press release was the, the intent for them to actually start testing the material? Yes, correct? absolutely. And I mean, in each case, these folks understand what scandium does. Uh, and we understand what Scandium does in their segment too because we've done testing, we've made materials, we have materials to offer them to test. But the key is each one of these is in an important segment and they have the research capabilities to test and prove to us and tell us that it works in their space. And that's very important. Well, I, I'm really excited actually about the 3D printing space. I know it was hot and then maybe people don't talk about it quite as much as a year or two ago. Yeah. But where does Scandium fit into that? Well, um, it, it will strengthen the uh, aluminum alloys that are used in 3D printing, and it will, uh, it will just simply behave better in that fairly harsh process of, of sintering powders or arc welding wires, which are pretty rough on the metals. Uh, Scandium helps those metals hold up under that process and give a better, stronger product, um, and it behaves better under those circumstances. Well, a lot of information for people yeah. to digest, but yeah. well worth people paying attention, I believe, to this area of the market. So, George, thank you very much, and we'll look forward to talking to you again. My pleasure, Jeff. See you soon.